Thanks for joining us for another Mayor's Minutes update. The Mayor of Crystal with us today, Jim Adams. Welcome once again. Thank you. Let's start with the state of the city coming up soon for you in a different way to be delivered this year. Tell us how it will be delivered and what are some of the topics? Well, this year we're going to deliver it via YouTube. So look for that in March. And what we're going to highlight this year is nothing really new, uh, but we'll cover our financial uh, priorities as well as our, our neighborhood priorities. We want to focus on our neighborhoods because we are primarily made up of neighborhoods. Also, uh, in inclusivity is another one of our focuses and that will be uh, drawn out in that report. All right, be watching for that. Let's talk about a neat event coming up for the sixth year, you understand, in the city. Yep. Neighbors recognizing neighbors. How can residents get involved? Well, this was one of our neighborhood priorities where we were trying to recognize the neighborhoods uh, the neighbors who are helping people in their own neighborhood, helping them get to know each other and highlight those and, and, and hopefully that will spread in our neighborhood. Uh, the way to get involved is you may elect someone in your neighborhood who's done something different or outstanding that really makes your neighborhood more rich. And you can nominate someone, uh, just go on the website, city mm -hmm. website, and the deadline for that is February 23rd, so we don't have a lot of time for that. All right, and recognition at a council meeting coming up in the month of April. Commission of Board Opportunities, as we start each year, opportunities for residents to get involved in even a bigger way. What are some of the openings right now? Well, right now we have Parks and Recs open, and then Environmental Quality Commission is open. We also have a position for the blue line. So if you have interest in the blue line and want to put some input in there, that would be a great way to take part in that. All right, again, crystalmn.gov to sign up, and that is by February 28th. How about podcasts? You guys are high tech in the city of Crystal. <laughs> You're doing some podcasts. What are the topics? How can people find those? Well, you know, those can be found on our website as well as iHeartRadio, uh, Google Play, uh, and iTunes. Pretty much anywhere you get your podcasts, you sure. can find them. Uh, and we cover topics that are very specific to the services that we have in Crystal. Sometimes we're talking about our housing stock and what's happening with that, uh, our businesses. All of our priorities, we end up putting something in there. Inclusivity, we've had some conversations about that and what we're doing with inclusivity. So uh, there's, some, there's some pretty good topics in there. All right, Mayor and Council members involved in those podcasts on a regular basis. Final note, we have a few seconds as we drive down 42nd. A lot of construction going on. How are things at the police building, City Hall? The police building is moving along very, very well. So we, we're on schedule. I might be a little ahead of schedule. I don't believe it'll remain that way, but we, we're crossing our fingers. Uh, hopefully by August of next year, we will have a staffed new police station. All right, great to hear. And again, a lot of information on the city's website, crystalmn.gov. Mayor, thanks again for your time. Look thank you. to talk to you again soon. All right, thank you. Learn more about The Connection at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.